All right, here are the parts that I'll be using to make a kayak outrigger for this kayak right here. I have two five feet long, one inch PVC pipe, two 90 degree elbow, 45 degree elbow and T-shaped T connector. Also, I got this from Walmart. I think this is $6 pool noodle and this is long. This is probably what, five inches? But it will fit perfectly with a uh, one inch pvc all right and i got some uh, metal screw as well uh this is not stainless steel but it, it can save you a lot of money if you just use regular screw for installation uh, i don't plan to spend too much money on this kayak because it's just a 200 dollars kayak the purpose is just to get me out there fishing so this is what i have so far i cut up some pvc pipe is the 8 inches, 5 inches, and 11 inches here. You need all three of the connector. And this is for, uh, it can be any size. This is for the noodle. All right, now you just need to put it together like Lego. And now I have put the, this one side of the outrigger together. This is the 8 inches piece, 5 inches and 11 inches. It looks like this. And I'll just put it here. It's looking pretty good. The PVC pipe, the form. Let me try to get it in with one hand. Okay. Hard to use one hand. Yep. There you have it. And there's a quarter inch hole right here. Put it in. Don't forget. Yep. Kayak okay, outrigger. It's all done. All I need to do is just put it in here. Oh yeah. Look at that. There you go. What I might do is to drill a hole once I test it out on the water to get the right height I'll just drill a hole here so that I can screw it in that way the outrigger won't be moving around like this it won't cost much 